Sandra Bullock is reportedly considering returning to the three Bs in the Bahamas to scatter Brian Randall's ashes in the sea. It comes after the Oscar-winning star's other half died at the age of 57 following a battle with ALS, a rare neurological disease that affects nerve cells, causing loss of muscle control. It was previously reported the location is where both Sandra and Brian exchanged vows in 2017, just three years before his devastating diagnosis with ALS. The place was just so special to them both. They would take over the entire island so they could just be themselves. It was a place where they shared some of their happiest times together and with the kids and friends, a source told the Daily Mail. They would go there for weeks at a time. It holds a lot of meaning and it just makes sense for that to be where she says goodbye to him. Philip Schofield not making return after this morning exit despite PAL's help express. Co.uk has contacted Sandra Bullock's representatives for comment. According to the same publication, Sandra and Brian never married and had exchanged vows in the Bahamas in an intimate ceremony witnessed by friends and family. Following his death, Sandra's sister Gazina Bullock Prado paid tribute to the 57-year-old, as well as publicly praised the Miss Congeniality star. She wrote, I'm convinced that Bry has found the best fishing spot in heaven and is already casting his lure into rushing rivers teeming with salmon. Don't miss! Jasmine Harman sparks frenzy in plunging swimsuit as she shares reality, latest. A place in the sun's John Irwin forced to undergo cancer checkup in car park, help, Kim Kardashian pokes fun at herself after failing to pass the bar, US, ALS is a cruel disease but there is some comfort in knowing he had the best of caretakers in my amazing sister and the band of nurses she assembled who helped her look after him in their home. Rest in peace, Brian. Sandra began dating Brian in 2015 and in the same year adopted her second child, daughter Layla. Their relationship developed, and he became a loving co-parent for her two children, Louis and Layla, now ages 13 and 11. On Red Table Talk in December 2021, the on-screen star opened up about the prospect of getting married again. I don't want to say do it like I do it, but I don't need a paper to be a devoted partner, devoted mother, she stated. I don't need to be told to weather a storm with a good man.